As Jesus was both God and man, a huge mystery, a mystery. So our life is, our life is a mystery. I, I don't believe that where I am today, I saw 25 or 35 or 40 years ago. I don't believe, I didn't see that. How did it evolve? It evolved by grace, chance, friends, support, people that said, you can do this, and people that said, you better not do that. And in that dialogue, in that back and forth, I, I, and I'm grateful, I'm grateful to be where I am today. Um, one of the real um, surprises you want of my life is I, in high school, um, I was probably an average or below average student, and not, I, I, would, I didn't excel at anything, but um, our high school was on the same property as a, a, a very big, iconic parish in Cincinnati. And if somebody <laughs> had said to me when I was in high school, someday you're gonna be pastor of that parish, I, I, I would have laughed out loud. But that's what happened. How did it happen? I'm not sure that I know all the, the answer to all that, but I believe that there's a way of saying, understand the failure. Don't let the failure make you depressed. Accept the reality that is and, and move ahead, limping slowly, asking for help, all of that stuff, all of that is real. And I don't, I believe that no one does this life alone, no one. What brings success to each of our lives is our ability to live in the midst of the craziness of our world, to make friends, to keep at it, to be truthful, to use the virtues that we've been taught since in our earliest years. Use them every day. They're hard. Help somebody that doesn't have as much. Be thankful for what you have. Try not to be too proud or too boastful, but try to give thanks for the gifts that you have.